Good evening. As you know, I would never make a video while drunk. So I just watched, and uh, I, I really like this uh, that uh, Ryan Boundless is making frequent videos because he just couldn't get enough people to go to his site, although it was a good idea. But uh, now he's criticizing. <laughs> he criticized the gym, the third world gym. By saying that something is third world, Ryan, he's, um, you're like hinting that it's not very good or it's not up to standard. But I, I looked at that gym, and I remember when I was in New Zealand, and uh, I said to this uh, guy called Gary from Birmingham, a black guy, I said, yeah, this is a good gym. And he goes, no, it's not. And that's the way it looks. It's got all the stuff in and... It's got loads of equipment, and uh, yeah, but, it's, but I'm from Birmingham, which is like, well, the population of Birmingham is probably bigger than the population of New Zealand, and uh, but the point is that it was it's had everything you needed, and uh, so did that gym. You're criticizing the gym because it's not the the bench press is not wide. <laughs> That's bollocks, Ryan, you're full of shit. It's it's a gym. There's so many ways there. What do you what the fuck do you want to do? What the fuck do you expect in that gym? Where the fucking the um, the fees to pass participate are very, very cheap. Where do you think they're gonna get the money from to buy like fucking let's say uh one hundred thousand dollars worth of equipment and then charge the locals fucking five pence or fifty cents or a dollar do you really think that is fucking apt you stupid fucking bastard you can't it is what it is there may be other gym. I, 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 in fact, I am betting there are better gyms in Kenya. Without a doubt, there are better gyms, but the local people cannot afford to go in those gyms. Look, I can, the the gym at the Marriott in town. It's like the membership was like a fucking million dollars. A million dollars to fucking to be a member of the Marriott gym. So how many so are you? The thing is, Brian, you wouldn't be willing to fucking pay a fucking membership, even if it was like thirty dollars a month. You wouldn't be willing to pay because you're a tight-fisted cunt. It's as simple as that. But being in a small village or a small town in Kenya or anywhere in Africa, that all those weights there would be sufficient enough to get to do what you want to do you don't even need weights you can do fucking press-ups you can do, you can do it against the wall you can get a single bar you can get like a you can get like a 15 pound 20 pound bar and you can do so many exercises with that above your head from lowering from your knees to your chest do like 100 at a time that's just as good it's just that uh, you're on the slippery slope. You've started attacking the gym. What are you going to be attacking next, Ryan? Just like you did in Japan. You started fucking pulling everything down, pulling everyone down. Now you're going to start on fucking Kenyans. And it's a good job there was no one in that gym because they would fucking hit you around the head with a fucking barbell. Fucking slagging them off. The reason why there's no fucking money in the country is because other countries fucking took it out. They stole all the fucking money. They stole all the wealth. This is why they are poor. You won't last long in fucking Kenya. You'll be out. You'll be out of there in fucking six months. I doubt you last fucking six months in Kenya. Arsehole. That's you, by the way, not me. 
Well, I may be one, but I'm directing this at you, not me, because that would be fucking silly, wouldn't it?